number five, we need to know uh, our trig identities to answer whether this question is true or false. We have that secant squared of pi over 10 minus tan squared of pi over 10 is equal to 1. So remember that our identity, uh, our trig identity involving tangent and secant is we know that 1 plus tangent squared of some angle x is equal to secant squared x. So you can see here, this is just rearranging this. If we subtracted the tangent squared to both sides, we would get secant squared minus tangent squared equals 1. So the only thing that you really have to check is, are the angles the same? Because the angles have to be the same for that identity to be true. They're both pi over 10, therefore this is true just by trig identity. So this is that one is going to be true.